Well, well, well. Howdy cowdies, eh? Hope we're all going good. Looks like we're back. This is the first weekly walkabout. Our first auction for God knows how bloody long. But we've got some good stuff. Some nice little bits of gold jewellery, a little Salvador Dali perfume bottle, some more sort of nice ebony bits and bobs and pearls and a nice old ambro type there. Some other groups of silver jewellery, other stuff. What else have we got? Really nice cutlery set, Schultzman, all complete and in the nice box, ready to go. Nice little filing cabinet, little pair of deco bedsides, Australian Playboy magazines, some cool DVDs, Astro Boy, Monkey Magic, little groups of furniture, trunks, auto trolleys, it's a cool old piano accordion in here. <laughs> what else we got? Old footy cards, big box full of footy cards and stickers. More Australian Playboys, um, cool kids' toys and stuff. It's all sort of blokey gear, tents and lawn leaf blowers and homebrew bottle sort of stands and work shelves and stuff like that. Nice big Noritake dinner set in those two boxes. Heaps of Collingwood Footy Club sort of merchandise and stuff. These are some nice lots of books. A bit of rock and roll stuff, some Pink Floyd DVDs. Got some cool clothes in the auction, some old dryzer bones. This is pretty cool, this 1970s sort of hippie coat thing. These are really nice as well, his and her sort of dressing gowns. Some great little retro, as new sort of 70s tops. We've got box lots of mixed stuff and things like that. Um, heaps of toys. Some lamps and lighting, some cool old sort of spotlights, industrial stuff and some retro gear as well. Boxes of DVDs and records. This is all Jerry Anderson stuff. Stingray, Joe 90, Thunderbirds. Cool rock and roll DVDs again. Stereo gear. Uh, costume jewellery. Lamps and lighting. Plants. Hot plants and stuff. Heaps of cassette tapes. Heaps of records. There's a lot of shit in the auction this week. We've had about four months to bloody gather it all together. Heaps of cutlery, nice little um, carpenter's plane and some other bits, some cool tools and stuff in the bin over the back. Stereo gear, more records. Sort of scientific instrumenty thing, moisture indicator. Some framed tapestries, cool old Forza Freestyle BMX. It's pretty cool. Some oil paintings there, big framed colourful canvases. Uh, some print, prints and pictures, a lot of occasional furniture. Kind of like the old pinball machine side. Some other bits, carpets and runners, photography and larges. Heaps of kids' toys and stuff. Cool old Esky, old Holden hubcap and some other gear in there. Tools, more audio gear. What else have we got? Boxes of dolls and stuff and old books and gear. Some framed prints and paintings and pictures. Got cool old magazines and stuff. Heaps of records this week. Some more cool DVDs. Big two shelves full of all the DVDs. Some kids toys. These are cool, all the old sort of oh boy magazines, pink. And there's some really cool old iron on t-shirt transfers and sort of top of the pops charts and things like that in that lot. Nice pair of Italian lamps from the 80s. Some cool old sort of prints and pictures. Heaps of glassware and crystal. Some antlers. Some anodized lights. A wheelbarrow and these things. I don't know what they are, sort of weird paddly things. All the lab glass and laboratory equipment. Some nice little mirrors and a little sort of hall shelf. These are a good lot of sort of military related books and some die casts. It's a great box of CDs, some cool gear in there. Uh, what else have we got? Some pictures and prints, a mannequin. We've got a big park bass guitar amp that I think's going with a bunch of guitars and stuff under the table. More Collingwood Footy Club gear. Lots of nice Art Deco hand painted China tea set down there. Some cool old boxing magazines, records. More records, uh, costume jewellery, they're plastic antlers, they're cool as, 
Uh, cut crystal and glass again, more records. Sort of motoring gear, some nice bits in this slot at the top, some nice Stuart sort of wine glasses over the back there. What else have we got? Some more Noritake China, early Biggles books, nice sort of sort of packaged as new kids toys. Pictorial history of Australia in the war, 1939 to 45, cool little five volume set. All good quality Dalton and Royal Albert China. Really nice old 8mm, I think, film projector there with the box to go with it. Pretty crazy painting of a clown over the back. They got a pith helmet and a nice little silk prayer rug from Egypt. Oh, I'm guessing it's from Egypt. Toll Toys train set there. Cool old tins, big, a lot of cut glass and crystal. More crystal, China. Some grog. Cowboy boots, guitar pedals. Tribal stuff, footies. Degar print, might not be a print. Cameras, books, more crystal, more records. Some cool old Akubra hats. Big horn. Pretty china. Oh, that's another cool little Ace Pathoscope 9.5mm projector with some film and stuff in there. More records, cute little lamp. Some interesting bits of pottery. That blue jug's pretty cool, no marks on it. More boxing magazines. Bangles and other records. Another nice little camera. U2 records. Some cool spinning tops and electric motors. Little box Chinese toys. White Horse whiskey statues. Nice little deco clock, needs a tidy up. It's cool, the big Walt Disney tin. Serving platters, some kids toy sets. Nice little lot of die casts. 1930s glass. Got a lot of photography gear and other sort of stuff. Nice little dolly. Some more boxing magazines. Pretty China. Nice little Lifetime Toys Australian made, sort of packaged as a new little toy duck. Ginger Megs and other comics. I oh, know it's not Ginger Megs, Super Comics. Records. We got some nice bits of China and stuff this week. These two nice old bottles. Loy Brothers, nice little lemonade there. O'Connell Bendigo. Some cool 1950s sort of dishes. Fantoni Italian one. Little set of four here as well that are unmarked. Some Aboriginal artifacts down the bottom. A dilly bag and some other bits. Capsella. Cool old 1930s deco tea set. Some signage, Oz Pottery. Gee, you can't see through that glass, can you? Nice big bit of art glass, the big bowl. Mailing, Falconware. These are nice bits of Victorian china. It's a little German mug, you can't see it, or you sort of can, but it's got a girl in the bottom. Never seen something like that other than the Japanese ones. Anyway, nice little duck decanter, Black Sabbath record, good quality china, Majolica. More little bits of carved tribal, little retro citizen clock. Some nice little bits of pottery from New Guinea and Canada. Else we've got the big red pussycats, fantastic. He's got his little bit of damage on the back, but he's pretty cool. Really nice collection of stamps, mainly Australian pre-decimal in all sort of different states. Costume jewellery, nice big part dinner set. Good little lot of Oz pottery. you got Robert Beck decorated by Margot Beck there. She signed it with her initials, MB. Nice little Van Nyckel pop and the Gunda ashtray over the back. Lovely bit of Italian glass. Nice bit of pool. Nice little sterling silver and tortoiseshell dressing table set. Wally's mate inspection book. He knew his mate did Wally. A couple of nice other little books. Little sort of African girl ashtray there. Some nice bits of 1970s and Art Deco China. Arabia. Percy Trezai's hand painted dish. Gus McLaren littered pot. Got some nice bits up the top here. Moorcroft, the lady head vase is a ripper. Nice bit of bosuns. Little Walt Disney Bambi figure. Oz Pottery sponge glazed jug. It's a cool bit of Gus McLaren there as well. The bowl with the cool star decoration. I really like the Japanese fighting cocks. <laughs> Copies of Italian ones, but they're good. And he's pretty cool over the back as well. The gold shider my figure from the 1950s. There you go, guys. We've got about 360 lots to get through on Thursday night. It'll be nice to get back into it. I think we're allowed about 30 people in the room, so we should be pretty sweet. Hopefully you saw something you liked. You know that I don't care if you did or if you didn't. What I do care about is that you're all well. All right, and we hope to see you here on Thursday night. Good on you guys. Take it easy.